This season is all about consistency. We need to be exceptionally consistent and good, like good consistent, not bad. I feel like I didn't explain that. Um, but because Real Madrid are very, very good, they're not going to drop many games. And we've started really well. What I didn't account for is Real Madrid being a bit shit. <laughs> I might just get gifted this. It'll be great. Maybe they saw my England save. I'm like, oh, let, let's just let him have this one. He needs it. Right, let's go have a look. Who's that over there? <laughs> Greetings and salutations, my friends. Welcome back. So, played a few games. Found a nice rhythm. We've had a decent run, to be fair. The, my, I think the most fun game I had was against Valencia, who we beat 5-0. They decided that no matter what was happening on this pitch, they were going to play out from the back. And it didn't go. <laughs> and they weren't good enough to play out from the back. And we just kept stealing it and jumping ahead, getting a goal. Lovely. We've also had the Champions League draw. Borussia Dortmund, Milan and... Zvezda? They're, they're Serbian. Uh, we've beaten them already. I thought I'd better come back for the Dortmund game. I'm assuming... I was going to say, I'm assuming they're second in the league. They've got one win in six. It's n not the best start. And also, just on a, as an aside, I don't think their third kit should be the exact same colour as their first kit. Just saying. Um, wow, OK. That was unexpected. But here's the league table. And here's Real Madrid. Sitting sixths. Um, yeah, so after they beat us, they <laughs> lost to Valencia, lost to Bilbao, drew against Sevilla. I don't know what's happening to Real Madrid. I feel like they should be doing better. They've lost both their Champions League group games. And Jesus, I don't know what's happening. But, you know, I'll take it. I thought I was going to almost need to win all the games and, you know... At least get a draw against them in the second game. No, 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 no. They're turd. I don't think they've... They did anything extra in the transfer window. Surely Ancelotti out. Um, oh, look. I didn't expect Gruish, because he was one of those players at Liverpool that was always like, oh, he's good. He's, he's going to be... Is he going to be good? He's going to be good. I'm not sure if he's going to be good. We'll loan him out. Oh, is he good? Uh, now, he's playing for Real Madrid for 25 million. Okay. <laughs> I wasn't expecting that. Medica. How much? 43. It's fine. What's Gareth Bale up to? Oh, he's in MLS, isn't he? Now? Yeah. <clears throat> I heard he's doing really bad in the MLS. Is that... Is that... Did I just make that up? Um, I'm sorry, my American friends. I don't keep a close eye on the MLS. Uh, the form is good. Um, Kessie is outperforming Biscuits. Rafinha had a rubbish start, let's be fair. But then last game, he's got a hat-trick and got an assist. Got a 10 rating, and I feel like I can't drop him. Um, so I like this partnership of Kessie and Frankie de Jong. They're both solid defensively, both solid passers. It's good. Jordi Alba is just disgusting still. Um, he's... He's an absolute beast, that guy. He's really he's one of my favourite left-backs. Um, and then we got Ronald and Gerard Piquet. I know I criticised him. He's got two and three. <laughs> I quite like the, the fact that we've got quite a small team as well. You know me, I don't I don't even have enough subs. But uh, I quite like the fact that they have... A, I don't like these giant teams. I, can't, I can never make a full substitutes bench. I could bring some youthies through, but they're never going to get on. All right. PK Masterclass. Right. Okay. Normally, I'd be like, tricky. This is good. Could go either way. But Dortmund are playing terribly. Um, let's have a look. I want to look at their team. Because I know they signed a bunch of players in the summer. And obviously, they lost the guy. Okay, there's Jude. How good is he in? Oh, I'd love to see him in Liverpool. He's going to Real Madrid, though, isn't it? I've just, I'm just accepting that he's leaving to go to Real Madrid because, so it hurts less. <laughs> okay. Oh my God, we have a 30 second highlight. Lewandowski with a free kick. He's already scored one this season. A good save, Koble. Koble? 
call him Cobble. It's, it's funnier. One of the things I'm doing a network save with a friend, and one of the things I'm really loving about FM23 is maybe you did it already, but I'm a simpleton. I've been able to get a sort of low block counter attacking longer football tactic to actually work and be successful. Might be a first for me. But then, you know, I signed some really good players and then I was like, no, 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 now we've got to demolish people. <clears throat> I'm wondering if it was a mistake to start Rafinha. Maybe that was just this one game where he's just a legend. I'm not his biggest fan. Nice run. Adiemi. Emre. Easy. Go on, Stegs. He's gone for a long bomb. Good header for Lewandowski. Kessie. Great ball out. Bellerin. He's been really good as well. I shouldn't have said that. He's won it back. Plays it across. Lovesley. Lay it off. Turn. No. Somebody shoot. Jordi Alba. There we go. <laughs> Comes steaming in. The and he... Specifically celebrates with the Dortmund fans there. Respect that. <laughs> Straight to the away bit. <laughs> he's, he's flying in. Look, he's off screen. <laughs> it's a great finish. It's a lovely finish. This would be huge result. Liverpool are doing fine. Ajax are doing all right. Ooh, Atletico Madrid. Come on, son. <clears throat> oh, Chelsea. No. Oh, Emre. Emre. Dwelling on the ball. Yeah, so this could be... Like, I know this is early. This is far too early, and I should learn from my mistakes and never talk about this, but this could be an easy season. <laughs> we might just win the league. There's Kessie. Might just do the double. Oh, dear God. We are all over them. They lost their first game as well. So if we can just beat them today, that's one foot in the knockouts, really. Right, Pedri can come on for the other youngster. Keep those legs fresh. I think the, the five sub rule just makes the game so much better for me. I'm not one that chops and changes my team every time. I like to have a nice settled team and obviously then fitness is a problem but when you can you know, go when you go 3-0 up you can make 5 subs at half time. Then it's it's quite nice. Tiredness is less of an issue. It's 2-0. It's got quite, I imagine he's, Robert sold, scored quite a few goals against Dortmund over his, over his few years. Goalkeeper made a wonder save that first one. Good old cobble. Right. Good. See it out. This is what we like. Give it. Let's have a look. Who fancies some action? Um, Dembele. Yeah. Rafinha, that was just a freak game where he played well. That's what I'm going with. Um... Memphis has not really set the world alight so far. Let's rest Jordi Alba. He's played pretty much every game so far. Bellerin has also played every game because we don't have any other right backs currently. Right. Dembele. Whip it in. Go on, Ronald! <laughs> <laughs> kind of feel a little bit bad for renaming him, but you know, that's his first name. It's his parents' fault. That's not on me. Shouldn't have called your kid Ronald. Maybe they're just big McDonald's fans. I don't know. Nice, Marcus. Scored a lovely goal. Oh, he's playing right back at the time. <laughs> right, Schlotterbeck. Kessie. He's on a yellow card, which is dangerous for him. He likes a tackle. That's nice. Dembele. Can he find Rob? Go on, Rob. It feels weird calling him Rob. But we're friends now, so... You know, that's what he asked me to call him. Lovely. 
Well, obviously, I, could, I couldn't go counter-attacking long ball football Barcelona. <laughs> I'd be shot. <laughs> I had to go a bit of tiki-taka. It feels only right. So despite what we've discovered then so far, despite the mountainous debt that this club has, and the fact they had to sort of, you know, not rebuild, but you know, semi-rebuild um, and have quite a small team. They've clearly have just, they've signed very good players because magic money, um, because money is irrelevant when you're rich. And, and so they've got a championship decent side. Like this is, they're on. We're on for the treble. <clears throat> Which is... It's almost sadder that they're that good. <laughs> Obviously, at least at least in the game, I don't think they're. I actually don't. I have not looked. I'm going to do this now live. Wait, just hop. Wait, okay, wait. I'm looking. Uh, oh, Pogba's out of the World Cup. Okay. Not a great miss. Um, tables. Can I just put Spain in? Or are you going to be very confusing? There we go. So currently, yeah, there's Barcelona a point behind. So yes, they are really good. It's amazing how badly run you can and how much you can fuck up a football club and make catastrophic errors. And it has had zero effect. Maybe in a few years it'll come back to haunt them, bite them or something. Um, but... Right now, it seems... It's just a bit sad, isn't it? It's just a bit sad. Right, I'm going to finish up there because I'm starving. And also, the next game is... You know, <laughs> I don't want to... You know, they're not, they're not that good. Um, do, but the question is, question of the day, which you won't be able to answer because I'm actually recording this the day before. Do I cook or take away? If so, what takeaway do I get? In fact, question of the day. If you had one, could only have one takeaway, one type, one variety of takeaway for the rest of time, what would you go for? For me, it's got to be a Chinese. Love a Chinese. Love a Chinese. Or burgers, because that's safe and you can always... There's, no, Chinese. I'm going Chinese. Right, let me know in the comments. Thank you very much for watching, as always. I love you all dearly. Thank you very much for the support, and I'll see you soon. Bye-bye.